Hi, my name is Morgan. I'm the owner of Holiday. We're a little clothing and decor boutique in Lifestyle Centre in Belito. So over the lockdown period, I got the opportunity to spend a lot of time at home with my family. It was a very special bonding time for me and my daughter. For the first time in a very long time, I think we actually had the time on our hands to really take a step back and look at our business and we had the we had the time to put in effort in terms of looking at different fabrics, different colors and really concentrating on our product and our ranges and what the way forward was going to be. I think the biggest lesson that we've learned personally and as a business owner is not to take anything for granted. You know, a few months back we had a great little business and all of a sudden something like this can just stop you in your tracks. One of the challenges that we faced is, obviously as a business, we lost out on Easter trade and that is the time of the year that really sort of carries us through the rest of the year. So it has been a little bit tough, but all in all, we have been extremely fortunate to be able to come back to work and for our business to survive. I think there are, I know there are a lot of people who really, really, this is, have been terribly affected by this. So. We've actually been very lucky, even though it's been sort of a more negative time, we've been exceptionally lucky and we've realized that. Another challenge we've faced is we travel a few times a year to beautiful places in Europe to bring back very special pieces for our store. And obviously there is not gonna be any traveling anytime soon. So we have really focused on getting our local production sort of up and running and really put a lot of effort into it in terms of working with our factory and working with our fabric suppliers to first of all find the most beautiful fabrics to make the most incredible pieces but at an affordable price. So we found I think when people come into the store they I think people are a bit frustrated with having to wear the masks and all the protocols, but I guess it's also just a sort of a topic of conversation at the moment, you know. As a store, we're doing everything we can in terms of keeping our space safe for them. We put up perspex in front of our counter, we sanitize our card machine, the door handles, and we've also got a spray that we spray all of our clothes and the hangers after any customers come into the shop. So all we can do is just reassure them that when they come in here, they're safe. Myself and all of the girls that work at the store, we feel like we've got a great relationship with our customers. We really put a lot of effort into the level of service that we give our customers and I think what we're going to do is just maintain that we're going to carry on delivering that but at the same time we've learned that we need to work our business a little bit more online we're posting more pictures on social media which before we've said we haven't had much time to do but we realized that it's actually super important the customers who come in are like our friends we miss you so yeah it would be lovely to catch up when you're ready